A community in mourning as the investigation into a high speed chase that ended with the death of a little five year old girl. Questions continue to mount about what happened during that chase and what happened to five year old Candace Harris. KNBC's Eli Roseberg is live in Atchison. Eli, what are people saying this afternoon? Well, talking to people since we've been here this afternoon, you get the sense they really don't know what to think. There are dueling pictures starting to emerge. One paints this man as a loving father by all appearance who really doted on this girl, and the other picture is the one painted by police. But this is what we do know. Five year old Caddy Harris died on Friday night. She went to a local preschool and had big plans to go to kindergarten in the fall. Police responded to a kidnapping call on Friday night, which led to a chase. By the time it was over, Harris was gone. I asked one neighbor what she thought about this. She knows Harris. Her granddaughter played with Harris a lot. And as you're about to see, she really struggled to answer the question. It just is inconceivable how such a thing could happen, knowing how much he cared for. That is just a sampling of what we've heard since we've been on the ground here in Atchison. Going to have a lot more reaction coming up tonight. The questions people have here, is so, there's so many non-answers, but we hope to learn more about that. That could go a long way to easing some of the grief that we continue to experience here in Atchison. For now, we're live here. Eli Rosenberg, KNBC 9 News.